All right, now we're gonna have a look at the inside of the trailer. We've got a nice step here. Bring the door. The door is, eh, it's actually better than I thought. So, screen and sliding access panel. So that works well. Just needs a new screen up top. Easy peasy. And the other part of the door, I think that's going to need a little bit more work. So we'll get to that. In here, we've got some boards down to protect from very soft floors. These floors will all be replaced. Our kitchenette has an ice box. Original color was that yellow that you can see, but someone decided that red might be a more attractive color. Our sink has the original pump valve, faucet, again, original beautiful yellow color, repainted. There's green paint chips, there's red paint chips, and there's a silver metallic paint chip, so we'll see if that can be saved, hopefully. And here's the gas stove. Three burner, propane gas, original yellow, looks like it has only gotten one layer of, or maybe two, oh yeah, there's a red under there and a silver, so see about salvaging that. So here's the rear of the trailer. Set up for, there's the top bunk bed or part of it. The other part would go over top of that bracket, meeting up with this bracket, creating what they call a double bed, although I think it's more of a generous single. I'll have to do the measurements for that. But that can be lifted up there's a bracket on one side and the bracket on the second side. And using those brackets, this whole thing can be lifted up. We've got an original light. You can see it looks like it's most likely had leaks through the weather stripping seams all along. Also through the window, but that's pretty much because there is no glass in those windows, so understandable. This side actually looks like it's in really good condition. Really good condition. So there's the bracket for the other, oh no, that looks like an add-on. Oh, someone did something there. A little towel rack. And that's the wheel well cover. Here is a cupboard. And our ceiling had some kind of a white paper on it, which is coming off. Here's our roof vent, which has seen better days, which will be fully replaced. And the plastic is cracked right up. That will be replaced. There's the other side of the vent from in the kitchen area. Got a nice set of cupboards. The electrical panel. Oh, someone left some dishes. There's our uh, significant water damage. So I don't know our roof's covered with snow right now, so we don't really know much about that. Um, Cupboards are in pretty good condition. This latch just doesn't seem to be working. Just needs a clean. We've got the original propane lamp. The other cabinet. There's a switch with the indoor light. Beautiful window. On this, back to this side again, we have the Glendale magazine rack. Again, just looks like a little bit of water damage around the windows. But the banquette looks... Oh, there you go. It's, that's the condition it's in. 
We've got the cabinet drawers there, so we'll be able to rebuild that hopefully. And the original countertop. And that light looks like it's the original porch lamp. Um, let's see, in the kitchen here. Here's the first drawer, which has some signs of life from the field. A little storage compartment for some critter's food. Um, cabinets under the stove. Two of those. And with the wheel well. And they're fully destroyed. Let's see here. Move this temporary flooring. Let's look in our ice box. layers of flooring under here. Oh, so there's the ice box. How cool is that? So the ice block goes up top and the food goes on the bottom and the sides. I'm not sure what's going to happen to that. But, uh, there I am. <laughs> so this is the project coming up. Wish me luck. See inside one more cabinet. So wire going through that wire is what was used to put on the running lights while it was driven over here. And again, some bees and hornets have made their home here. And that's oh, just the cover for the wheel well too. The wheel well looks more like a chip. And there's the outside of the cabinet. Damage, damage, damage. So this unit has been outside in a field for about 30 years where snow was able, allowed to enter straight through all of these windows and melt. So it has experienced quite a lot of damage. However, because it was always open, it was always allowed to dry up. So I'm hoping that that means it could be worse. Let's see what's under here. Oh, there's a little box. How cute is this? Look at this little box. What's in here? It's a ladies box. Oh, there's condoms. Wow. Some condoms from a long time ago. And some motion lotion. That's the sexy box. Wow, that's the box of fun. So, looks like this uh, camper was a rockin' at one point. See what else we have under here. Oh, an exercise equipment. It's that thing where you pull the springs with two hands and chest exercises. Some tubes. Oh, I see a birdie back there. Wow. Good times. Actually, that will be our original flooring. So maybe we'll have a chance to find something similar to that. That's pretty cool. All right. Well, I uh, hope you enjoyed our first tour of the of the trailer of our new trailer. Merry Christmas to me. This is my gift, and uh, hopefully we can make this something beautiful see you there see you later